He's really disappointed in me right now. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a lot of hate mail from like a bunch of Star Wars fans. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Dark Angel Beauty. I'm Andy, thank you so much for tuning in today. Um, today we're gonna do a little bit of a different video, but before I jump into that, I just wanna say thank you guys so much for all the support you've shown us so far. We're growing so quickly and our videos are getting a really, really good response, better than we even expected, especially at first. So I just wanna say from the bottom of my heart, thank you, I know Nikki feels the same way I do. We really appreciate all the support. And to each and every one of our viewers and subscribers, we love you from the bottom of our hearts and we hope that you stay with us through this journey because we know we're only gonna grow from here. Um, that being said, I do wanna let you guys know that when we hit 100 subscribers, we are going to be doing a giveaway. I haven't quite picked all the stuff that's going in the giveaway, but the closer we get to 100 and the more you guys are pushing it and helping us grow, we're going to drop more surprise hints about what you'll be getting in the giveaway if you win. Um, and we'll be doing that, like I said, when we hit up 100 subscribers. So definitely encourage your friends to follow if they haven't followed us and share our video as much as possible because we really appreciate it and we really appreciate you guys. Now that that's out of the way, like I said, this is going to be a little bit of a different video, but we are planning a trip to Disney. We'll be leaving August 10th, so we're leaving very, very soon. Um, and I just wanted to kind of give you guys a look at some of the stuff that I've picked up to bring with us to Disney. Um, funny enough, I've literally never been to Disney before. I've never been to Disney World. I've never been to Disneyland. I have never been to any of the Disney parks before. So this is my very first time. Nikki, on the other hand, grew up in a family that went like for multiple weeks a year. So he's been tons of times. He's really excited to take me and for us to experience it together. Um, because of that, we've actually gotten some custom made shirts that are matching because like, you know what? If you're gonna do Disney you might as well do Disney so we're gonna be that couple that matches pretty much the entire time we're there um, and then I also picked up some accessories um, we ordered those off Amazon and I wanted to share those with you guys today the t-shirts aren't quite ready yet um, we've got a family friend making them and hopefully she's okay with it I would like to do a haul video of those when they finally are ready um, but I have to talk to her about that first but today I wanted to show you the stuff that we picked up accessory wise for Disney that we're gonna be bringing with us in August when we leave. The first thing, this is actually not a new item that I own. This is just something that Nikki got for me forever ago because as you can tell, he's a huge Star Wars fan. He got this from, I think his last trip to Disney. Um, he brought this home for me because I did not go with them to that one. Uh, but he also, he got me this, let me make sure I'm showing you that. It's an R2-D2 dress from, is it not? It's a Stormtrooper? Oh, yikes. It's a Stormtrooper dress, which I totally knew. It's a Stormtrooper dress that he got me forever ago. So, yeah. <laughs> He's really disappointed in me right now. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a lot of hate mail from, like, a bunch of Star Wars fans. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think he just broke up with me on film. <laughs> this is going to be really awkward now, so... <laughs> Anyway, it's a Stormtrooper dress, and he's really hoping that Galaxy's Edge is open by the time we go. Um, I think their actual open date is, like, the, the week after we're there. So he's hoping they're going to do, like, a little bit of limited access, and we're going to get to go for, like, four hours or so one day. Um, I know he's really excited about that, so I'm hoping it happens, too, just because I want to experience that with him, and I want it to be this trip. Um, but we'll see what winds up happening. Obviously, we're going to be taking videos and doing stuff while we're there as well. So hopefully you guys will get to live some of the stuff with us as well. This is all the new stuff that we've gotten. So the first thing is um, I love bags. I always have loved bags. I love purses. So I'm typically very picky about the bags that I get. Um, but for this one, I just wanted something cute that I could kind of throw on my back and wouldn't have to worry about, but also fit the theme of Disney. And we found this on Amazon. And I think it was like $17. So it was just so adorable. And I don't know if you guys can see, but it's got little mini ears and it's got a little bow. It's so tiny. Like it honestly, I mean, but we're not going to be bringing a lot of stuff. Maybe our IDs and a wallet and our phones, just some stuff that we can keep in here, potentially a camera, depending on what kind of film equipment we're going to bring with us. But it's a really decent size. It's got an adjustable strap, so you can either have it as like a crossbody bag or you can have it as a backpack bag. Um, but yeah, so that was the little Minnie Mouse purse bag that I picked up so that I could have something that would fit the theme that was compact that I also could carry the few things that we're going to be bringing with us into the parks. 
So this was really cool. And like I said, at $17.99 or whatever, that was a really big steal in my opinion. Um, I think it's a pretty quality pleather bag for a good price. Maybe it's because I never went as a child, but I feel like the mouse ears are like part of it. Like you just have to have those to experience Disney fully. And so I went crazy and I was like, you know, I know the ones they sell in the park are like really expensive. So we found a good number of ones on Amazon that were pretty cheap. Um, this was a combined set. I think it was $12.99, you got two pairs. And <laughs> y'all know me, I love my glitter. They're glittery, of course, because I wasn't gonna wear anything that wasn't glittery. So I got, um, and at the time I was really planning on still having like purple hair, but life happens, so I don't have purple hair anymore. But I got uh, pink, like a deep pink and a light pink, like a blush color. That's what came in this set. If I had known that my hair was gonna be this color when we went, if I had really thought about it, I probably would have ordered the red and the blue pair because I really liked those. But like I said, life happens. So, but they're super cute, right? I mean, I'm very, I'm a very big fan. And like I said, I don't know if it's actually going to be practical while I'm there. I'm probably gonna be sweaty and I'm sure we're gonna be riding rides. So I'm probably gonna have to take them on and off just because when you're riding a ride, it, I don't really want to be on Splash Mountain and have my ears go flying off and like hit some kid in the face and then that'd be like a whole thing. So Nikki shrugged because he doesn't care, but that's because he's a bad person. So I think they're both super, super cute. I feel like I'm just going to leave them on in between because now that I pushed my hair that has not been brushed and like was up all day back, it actually looks a lot better. So, but these are really cute. I mean, you can tell it's like the ears are a little uneven and the bow's a little uneven, but for $12 for two, that's $6 a pair. I mean, at the parks, they're like $25 a piece. So I'm very fine with them being a little off center for the affordability of it. Um, and I think they're going to really, I really kind of coordinated the shirts. Um, hopefully I'll be able to show those to you guys soon. Um, but when you guys see the shirts matched with the ears, I think we did a really good job of kind of picking out ones that would match. So, um, but I'm pretty sure these were $10.99 and this, I just wanted a nice classic pair of like the red mini bow ones. <laughs> these are so cool. I can't wait to show you guys this. I'm very excited about this one. So this actually feels a lot nicer because it's got like a kind of a felt tip. These are, this is more like a hard edge. I don't know if I can do this. I feel like I'm, I'm oh gosh, I'm doing this in a mirror and I don't think I have the, uh, oh, there we go, figured it out. There we go, good team. All right, so these are like those reversible sequins, which I don't know why, but I'm so obsessed with those. I feel like they're just the coolest things in the world. So I was like, yeah, I can have silver ears or I can have black ears. So it's almost like having two pairs in one. So for $10.99, we got these and they're so cool and I could sit here and rub my ears all day. I'm not going to, but I could. Um, I've got one more pair of ears to show you guys. This is the last thing that we have for Disney right now in terms of what I'm bringing outfit wise. And if you haven't been able to tell based on the skulls and my name and like my whole aesthetic as a person, I'm very into dark things. Halloween is my favorite time of year. I love horror movies. I love all things creepy. If it were up to me, I would be celebrating Halloween 100% of the time because it's just very much who I am as a person. And I don't know why I've always loved it, but I have. But because Disney is Disney and we're going in August, they like to be extra and they are actually starting their Halloween celebration while we're there two months early. And I'm so excited. And when we're going with Nikki's family, when his grandma told me about it, I was like, yes. So we're doing a Halloween night and I had to get at least one outfit that was specifically for that day that I could enjoy my holiday like I want to. And so to match that aesthetic, I picked up these super cute ears and they're like, I'm not going to lie, they're a little flimsy because they're obviously, I mean, you can tell they're like, they're cutouts. So obviously they're going to be a little bit harder to maintain, but they're just, I could, how could I resist this? I feel like if anybody really knows me, this is me in a person in ears. Like this is who I am represented from my soul, radiating outwards into your viewing pleasure home. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know it's very different from our normal content. It was not really beauty related. It's more of like a fashion haul, if you can call it that. But I mean, this is kind of what I want the channel to become anyway when I start. I haven't bought clothes in a while, but when I do, I'm gonna be hauling it for you guys on the channel. So um, like I said, when I get the t-shirts in, hopefully we'll be able to show you guys those as well and you can kind of see that. 
But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you're notified every time we post a video. And when we go to Disney and we post videos about that, you'll be able to stay up to date with that as well and experience it with us. Um, as always, I love you guys with all my heart. Thank you so much for all the support you've shown us. And I hope you guys stay girly, but with a dark twist.